All right, what's popping, everybody? Been making a lot of beats the last year, and we wanted to bring a little randomizer in the mix. So what we did was, with Google's help, find out what key we should be in, what BPM we should run, what instruments we should use, and then kind of take that bag of tricks and make something dope out of it. So to brief you, 68 was the BPM. For the key, we got E major. And the last thing was the instruments. We, I think we got six instruments we need to use. Of the six, it was vocals, effects, string, key, percussion, and bass. And then we realized, well, bass and drums are gonna go in everything anyway, so we'll just throw those in the mix. So I think it was seven banks total. And everything from Splice. No, oh yeah, everything from Splice, from Splice. <laughs> not sponsored. Yeah, this is this is what we got for the key, at least cooking. There was a couple we were going to pick from. That one was moody, honestly gave us kind of like a swimming type vibes. We didn't know what kind of genre we wanted. Yeah, genre is questionable. We were thinking maybe you do some trap shit, you know, have those hats run in the show, 16th, 32nd note hats, or we do some slower, true 68 moody something and, and maybe throw an element in there that makes it feel a little bit more upbeat. And we did that with the uh, with the ride, with the ride pattern. Mm. Um, the, the kits... Was we built the kit together? The ride was a loop we took just because, like, it was a cool ass ride. We're not gonna leave it there. Uh, but all that being said, we will give you the drums now. All right, so there your there's your drums, um, big delicious. warm, <laughs> delicious, yeah, big warm buttery kick. The perk is also in there. I will note that real quick. We put the perk under the snare. It was kind of a cop out way to use a perk, but we were hearing woodblock, clave type deal, we tried and a bunch of shit. We tried too many things. Um, what was next? Okay, we did the drums. I think at that point, Andy started playing bass. Um, well, I was just slinging vocal sounds around and probably didn't really oh, help that's him. When you found the string. Oh, yep. We found a bunch of loops. That's where you're like, you know what? We're just going to chop it down. So I, I, it's like a one beat, but it's, it's pretty powerful. Kind of sexy, kind of sad. Next was, then the bass. I think that was where the bass came in. It sounds cool. A little funky, a little walk around, right? Yep. But simple. Simple. Yeah. And it was an eight bar. Yeah, this one we actually, we chopped it up. We, we got the eight bars. We chopped it up. We realized, well, the chops sound a little better. And he was a little sloppy that night. A little loose. A loose on the timing. Sounds good. I might as well play it for you now. that bass <laughs> <laughs> the bass is gorgeous uh next was vocals found a bunch of vocals chopped them a bunch down listened to a bunch the one we found kind of just like fit really well once again why use the whole loop the back end of the loop didn't really matter it just didn't make sense i think we cut it to like a bar to faded the the end of it so like you got the build up it hit its peak and then it kind of died down before like that second or third snare or whatever it is fits pretty nice this is what it sounds like so yeah that's the vocal i think next we might as well talk about the the effects because that also ended up being basically a vocal. <laughs> a vocal but it's in the effects category so it counts it was a two an eight bar vocal we chopped the first one out it kind of died on its own so like didn't really have to do much so yeah, let's listen to that. All 
Um, yeah, sounded real cool. Okay, so we're realizing now we we kind of overdid the uh, the vocals on this one, maybe, but <laughs> they're all different types of vocals, kind of in turn, all different types of effects. Um, there was one vocal vocal loop or chop, whatever. Sounded real cool. The coolest part was the end of it. It's just like a little like type of delay stabby note in yeah. there. Um, so we chopped that down. We played it twice and just kind of used it as like a little stab, a little filler with the decay of it. So yeah, this is it. It's cool. Money. So yeah, you're probably not shocked. The last piece was another vocal. <laughs> <laughs> another one. This vocal sound we had in a bank, we chopped it down because it was like a, there was multiple different like sayings with it or whatever. We found one. We put it on the keyboard. Andy hit it an octave lower and just like the drugged out slow. Just the chopped and screwed. Yes. It sounded beautiful. And it had some like coolness over the one because we put it on the back half of, of the bar and whatnot and then used the front of it as like another little stab for like a hooks a hook section. And yeah, this is this is what it is. <laughs> it sounds up it sounds good it sounds real good it sounds good i think there's one piece left what piece is left the wubs oh true i mean we we stacked up a bunch of effects and went through them all and they're all cool a lot of alien sounds there was like a a bouncing like we called it a wub adds a good layer it gives a good break of no keys for a while sounds good in the arrangement thanks andy um but yeah Two, two sections, lower section, higher section, just kind of like hit them multiple times to ha have it fit a little bit more chopped up. Um, this is what it sounds like. So that's it. That is it. That's it. We made it to the end. Thank you, Google, number one. Who else do we thank? Uh, shout out uh, D Flight on the Celtics. Uh, and that's it. Yeah, so we're gonna let the whole beat ride Like subscribe comment. Yeah, if this sucks. Let us know if it's great. Let us know We're probably gonna do more of them either way because we had fun and they're only gonna get better. Hopefully I right, peace <laughs>